What's up guys, Zach here with Dr. Eyeball MD. I'm a second year ophthalmology resident. I'm gonna take you along with me tomorrow through the clinic, through the OR, day in the life of an ophthalmology resident. Let's go. So it's about 6.20 a.m. Going in to the OR, we start at seven. We have six cases. Um, and then we'll go to clinic after. So far we've done one case. We did a toaster repair with uh, internal toaster repair. We did a mullerectomy. Um, as well as lower lid atrophy on on both sides. I did a lateral partial strip on both sides. I've proven two for partial nasolacrimal duct obstruction. Um, and I got to close some of the skin on the uh, lateral canthotomy. There were two fellows in addition to the attending, so I didn't get to do a whole. So now we're about to do the second case. Uh, five more today in total. And then we'll go to clinic this afternoon. We have a temporal artery biopsy. Um, so it should be good. Let's go. All right, so in that last one, we did a repair of a uh, scar that a lady had on the forehead. We just opened that back up with the plastic surgeon, and I actually closed it, helped close, close it back up. And then we also did a probe and tube of her nasolacrimal duct because she had scarred here from an old injury, and so it had stenosis and scarred over, so we probed that place the tube so it can uh, recanalize and open up, and then we'll remove that tube later in clinic. Now we're about to go do a Mohs reconstruction in the left lower eyelid area. It's a big defect here, so we'll go close that. Um, it might have to do like a full thickness skin graft, maybe from behind the ear, like a supraclavicular, so we'll see. Okay, so we just did a bilateral uh, external ptosis repair uh, with the levator advance. It was kind of a tricky case. It was tougher, tough for the attending to get, but got it and uh, now, we had one Mohs reconstruction that actually didn't involve the eyelid, it involved more of the face, so the plastics team is gonna do that. And then we have another Mohs reconstruction that we are gonna do. So, we'll do that. So one more case and then we'll go to clinic. And it's about 11.30 right now. Okay, so now we are done in the OR. We did the Mohs reconstruction, so now I'm gonna head over to clinic. Yeah, the girl, she's on the way. Okay, we're finished in the OR, so um, we finished the Mohs reconstruction, so now I'm gonna go to clinic. I think there's like 19 patients. And after we finish seeing the clinic patients, Oh, and there's one uh, temporal artery biopsy in clinic. So I'm trying to hurry over for that before they do it, uh, before the attending and fellow do it before I get there, because I want to see it uh, and hopefully help with it. But um, after that, we'll see the clinic patients, and then we will go help the general clinic, the first, first years, if they're still going after we're done. So we'll see. Okay, so driving back to the clinic, which is in a different building than the outpatient surgery center. Um, eating my grilled cheese sandwich on the way. I actually got to do a pretty good, uh, well not, not as much today as I did the other day, but a decent amount, you know, suturing, closing the eyelids, that kind of thing. Um, a little, I could do a little less when there's a fellow and attending there. If there's just, if it's just me, I'm not a fellow, then I get to do more, which is better. Um, but it was fun. I like getting to do those kind of, those kind of surgeries. Um, and I like suturing, so. I'm still trying to decide if I want to do oculoplastics or uh, just comprehensive ophthalmology or maybe even retina. I'm kind of down to those three, so we'll see. Anyways, we have time now because they've actually moved back the oculoplastics match, so it's not as early. You don't have to decide as early, which makes more sense. Um, but they would give you a little more time to decide on that. I tend to leave this hat on for the entire day because once I put it on, there's no coming back from my hair. So I just leave the hat on, um, play surgeon, and don't worry about it.
All right, it's about five o'clock, so we finished the clinic. It went pretty fast. We did the temporal artery biopsy right there in the clinic in the minor's procedure room. But it's kind of neat that we actually do that in the ophthalmology clinics. In some places, we'll actually have the vascular surgeons do all of that. Like plastics doctors do it uh, right there, so it's pretty cool. Um, so the general clinic's done, so we're leaving now. That kind of wraps up the day, basically. We're gonna go home, so not a bad day. We went from about 6.45 this morning until five, so not too bad. All right guys, so that pretty much wraps up the day. We had a good day. We started in the OR, we did five cases. We did some Mohs reconstruction. So after the dermatologist comes in and removes cancer from around the eyelids, the oculoplastic team will come in and actually repair those defects, put the eyelid back together. We did some ptosis repairs. Then we headed over to the clinic, did a temporal artery biopsy in the clinic, and then we finished up clinic and we're done by five. So good day overall. Really enjoying the oculoplastics rotation. I hope you guys liked the video, following along with me um, during a day in the life kind of thing. If you guys like it, leave a like and subscribe, turn on the bell notifications, we'll be coming out with more videos. I'm Zach with Dr. Eyeball MD and I'll see you guys next time.